Welcome back to our tutorials on how to leverage the Your Coach Health coaching platform for your health and wellness coaching practice. My name is Ashley Honeycutt. I am the Director of Health Coaching Operations here at Your Coach Health, as well as a nationally board certified health and wellness coach myself. For the sake of the tutorial today, we're going to be working in the web-based version of our platform. We do also have an app version for your phone. We're also going to assume that you've gone through the steps to set up your practice and set up a program within the platform. If you haven't done those things yet, make sure you go back and watch those tutorials first. We're going to dive right in. So when you're on the Your Space screen right here, which is this little home button, you'll see Your Space at the top. You can click on the toolbox function. It's going to bring us right here. You'll see a couple of different things. We've got our food diary here and below you'll see the forms and questionnaires as well as some of our digital tools and therapies on the bottom. We're going to go to create questionnaire. When we go here, we have two different options. So we can leverage a template that's already here for us where we can pick and choose from different questionnaires and niches, things to go ahead and use a form that we can modify and make work for our practice. It just makes it easier to set this up from the get-go, or we can start fresh and create a completely new questionnaire. Let's go ahead and start today from a template. So I can go here. And it's going to guide me through the process, make this super easy. So I can give it a photo for the cover. So I'm going to go ahead, going to open that up. Can't wait for that to upload. Once that cover photo is right there, I can go ahead and give my questionnaire a name. So this one, I'm just going to call the onboarding questionnaire. I'm going to send this to every client when they come into my program. I can give it a description. So this could be something like, welcome to your coaching program. Please fill out this questionnaire to help me understand your goals and habits. Okay, we're gonna hit continue. And this is where we're gonna start putting in the questions that are most helpful for us. So. We've got personal information. This ranges from everything from name, email, how often they check their email, phone number, um, any preferred pronouns, gender identities, age, height, weight. Um, if we need to know weight six months ago, one year ago, if we're looking at habit change for weight tracking, that could be here. You can also add questions. So if I wanted to add a question, I could click right here, type in any question that I want and add it. I can also delete questions. So if I didn't want these, I could easily delete these. I can also modify questions. So if I wanted to make this instead of height, let's say I wanted this to be um, something about, uh, maybe I want current BMI. I could put that here and change this. I could also change it from a text field where they can type in any text that they want to multiple choice, I could give ranges, or I could do check boxes if this was a question where I wanted them to be able to check off different things. Of course, I can add other choices, as many as I would like here, um, or I can make this a required field, or I can toggle this off to where it is an optional field for them to fill out. Again, I can delete and modify any of these questions that I would like. I can hit continue and it's gonna take me to the next section, which would be to complete. I'm not really ready to complete yet. I wanna add some more questions. So I'm gonna look at these social information questions and let's say I don't really want any of the social information questions. This isn't pertinent to my coaching. I can easily just go through here and I can delete all of these and you'll see it removed that section. Same thing, I can go into health information, I can delete and modify any of these and go through each and every one of these. We've purposely included a lot of different questions for a lot of different niche areas to try to set you up for success and make this process as easy as possible. Remember, you can modify any of these questions and you can add any questions that you want, take away any questions that you want, and of course, you can make them required or optional. So you can go through all of these, once you are done, you can even add a section if there's an entire section you want to add to this questionnaire. Super easy. We can put a section in here. Let's say you are looking at um, menopausal health. We want to do a whole section on this. I'm going to add that in here, and then I can easily add questions directly to this section. Once I have finished with all the sections that I'm interested in modifying, I can hit continue. 
that's going to bring me back to the screen, which is that final step before the questionnaire is completed. And I can see how many total questions are in this questionnaire. We know we want to make these questionnaires easy for our clients. We want to be able to get the all the information that is pertinent for our coaching practice and is really helpful without it being overwhelming. So it's helpful to see the total number of questions because we always want more information, right? But it's helpful to know what kind of load we're putting on our clients in the beginning. So this is great information to have. Uh, again, you can scroll through and see what the questionnaire looks like in its entirety. Once you get down to the bottom, you'll see you can create this questionnaire. So here I'll click create. And now I see that this onboarding questionnaire has populated as one of my forms and questionnaires. This is great because it saves it. So I can reuse this questionnaire over and over again. I don't have to recreate it every time I get a new client. You'll also see these three little dots right here. This will allow me to duplicate it. So let's say I have a new client come in who maybe this is going to be a male client and I've only worked with female clients thus far and I have this female health section within the questionnaire. I can duplicate this questionnaire and then just erase all of those female health questions and it makes it super easy. I don't have to start from scratch. I can also edit the questionnaire. So if I find that there are questions I would like to tweak later on, super easy to do that. And of course I can delete it and most importantly, I can send it to my clients. So I'm gonna go ahead and hit send right here. And let's say I wanted to send this to Rowan. I could very easily just click her name right here. Boom, it's sent. And you'll see you earn points in our gamification process, which earns you towards our perks and tiers. So that is one way I can send it to my clients if they're already in the platform. Another way is if I wanted to invite them by email. So if I were here, I could again hit these three dots. I could ask it to send it. And then I can invite them by email by easily just typing in their email here. I hit the little person with the plus sign and then I can send the questionnaire this way. Now let's say you wanted to create a questionnaire completely from scratch. I would come here and hit the create questionnaire button and it's gonna guide me through the process. I'll hit create new questionnaire. I can upload a cover photo. Again, I'm gonna name this one just to keep it easy. We'll do onboarding. It's gonna be a shorter questionnaire. I can also upload a cover photo here. I'm gonna add a section. I can create my own section, or again, you're gonna have the option to add from those section templates. So I'm gonna take a peek at these templates and I'm gonna go with the personal information. I wanna add this to my questionnaire. I can click on that personal information and again, I can edit these. So let's go ahead. I'm going to parse this down. Remember I said this one was gonna be a short one. So let's make it super easy. I just wanna collect some generic information about this client. And I'm gonna update it. And now I have this super easy questionnaire available to send. I can use it just like I utilize the other one, those three dots there. I can duplicate it, edit it, I can delete it, and of course I can send it to my clients. Once your client fills out that questionnaire, you're gonna get a notification up here in your notification bell section. We can click on that, it's gonna pull up all of our notifications. You'll see that somebody has completed that questionnaire. You can click directly on it, and it's gonna bring you and show you the status, and you can see all of their answers. Again, you can also see anybody that you've sent it to, how many questions they've answered so far, and the status if it's sent, if they've begun it, or if it is completed. You can also get to this screen by the generic forms and questionnaires page. So let's say I'm here, I can click on the questionnaire I have a question about, and you'll see the status part right here. I can click on it, and again, I can see everybody I've sent it to and the status of those questionnaires. I can click directly on their name and it'll pull up all of their information. We hope this tutorial has been helpful for you. Should you have any other questions or we can help in any other way, please feel free to reach out utilizing the blue headphones right here in the platform. It will connect you to our support team. Have a wonderful day.